So we just relaxing and everything. But he asked me about East New York and he asked me, do everybody come here, do everybody? No, if I was from another borough and whatever, why would I come here? This is the Medina. They get live out here when it's time to get live. Is this like a so, tight community? It can be. It can be. It can be. Then it could be fed up because you can have your nigga you grew up with motherfucking blow your brains out for some frivolous. Roberts, rapes, was a war zone. East New York, Brooklyn, 75 precinct, deadliest precinct in the country. Listen up. Let me share with you the remarkable journey that has brought me here today. Now that you know more or less where I come from, allow me to reintroduce myself. I am Jimmy Perez, a pilot from the heart of Brooklyn, New York City. Growing up in a neighborhood plagued by danger, crime, and drugs, I encountered numerous obstacles. Yet within those challenges, I discovered resilience and determination through my wife's career I connected to the realm of aviation and found a path to a better life. As I dig into the captivating pages of Kurt Vonnegut's A Man Without a Country, one quote resonated deeply within me. We are what we pretend to be. So we must be careful about what we pretend to be. Regardless of our backgrounds, where we come from, this quote reminds us that our actions and aspirations shape our identities. It emphasizes the importance of authenticity and being mindful of the roles we assume. For me, this quote resonates on my journey to becoming a pilot. Despite the challenging circumstances of my upbringing, I refused to let them define me. Instead, I chose to pretend to be a person of discipline dedication, and unwavering passion. And in doing so, I transform into that very person. As I pursue my dream of becoming a pilot, I wholeheartedly embrace the role, projecting an image of safety and expertise, not only for the future passengers who will trust me with their own lives, but also for the young individuals who look up to me as a guiding light back home. Just like the protagonist in Vonnegut's story who yearned for a place to call home, I found my true address in the skies. You see, aviation has become more like a sanctuary, a realm where I transcended the limitations imposed by my neighborhood and reached new heights. <laughs> yeah, both literally and figuratively, that is. You see, the flight deck transformed into a sacred classroom where I absorbed the lessons of discipline, precision, and unwavering dedication. Each flight from takeoff to landing reminded me of the immense responsibility and privilege I held as a pilot. It taught me to navigate through the turbulent skies, both literally and metaphorically, with resilience and determination. Similar to the protagonist's transformative journey, I to evolve into the person I am today, into the pilot I am today, driven by passion to inspire, a passion to uplift, a passion to make a difference. Through pilot programs like the JetBlue Gateway family, I am achieving my dreams. And it doesn't matter how long it takes me. It doesn't matter how long it would take you. The most important thing is that every step of the way you refine your skills in aviation. But most importantly, forging deep connections with fellow aviators who accompany us through this journey. My experiences and the challenges I faced throughout my youth has shaped me into the man I am today. We are what we pretend to be. So we must be careful about what we pretend to be. The quote from a man without a country serves a powerful reminder that our actions and aspirations define us, transcending the boundaries of our origins. It is through my passion for aviation that I have overcome the limitations of my neighborhood, defined the odds to pursue a fulfilling career, and positively impact the lives of others. 
disconnection of my life and the aviation world fills me with awe and gratitude, deepening my understanding of perseverance, purpose, and transformation. As I continue to navigate the pages of life and transverse the vast blue canvas of the sky, I do so with a profound sense of purpose. I am Jimmy Perez, a pilot whose journey defies expectations, inspiring others to reach for the skies. Together, let us soar to new heights and embrace the transformative power of flight, transcending the boundaries that once confined us. Each flight I undertake is not just an opportunity for personal accomplishment, but also a chance to connect, inspire, and leave a lasting impact on the lives of those I encounter. It is this unwavering belief that fuels my determination and propels me closer to my dreams. With every passing moment, I strive to become the pilot who transcends the boundaries of gravity and touches the heavens. The sky is not my limit. It is an expansive expanse awaiting exploration. As I navigate through the pages of life, I do so with a profound sense of purpose. I am driven not only by my own aspirations, but also by the knowledge that my journey can inspire others to defy their own limitations and reach for the skies. I want to be a role model to my son James. I want to be a role model to many, be an example to friends and family. In the tapestry of aviation with passion, skill, and purpose intertwined, I have found my place. A place where dreams take flight, where barriers are broken. A place where I, Jimmy Perez, am destined to leave an unforgettable mark on the ever-changing skies. From my troubled neighborhood to the man I am today, a proud father, husband, and pilot, I am a living proof that we have the power to shape our own destinies. As I continue to chase my dreams, I invite you all to join me on this incredible journey. Let us defy expectations. Let us break barriers. Let us inspire others to reach for the skies, where the skies know no limits. Thank you for being part of my story. May we all continue to soar to new heights together. And now, allow me to finish with words of a poet. In the realm of prose where stories take flight, a man without a country, a literally delight, Kurt Vonnegut's masterpiece of symphony of words, metaphors and rhyme like soaring birds, his pen, weaves tapestries rich and profound, metaphorical landscapes where meanings are found. Each line, a brush stroke painting vivid scenes, from the depths of his mind, imagination gleams. Like a sculptor of language, he molds and shapes, creating characters, their souls he drapes. Through humor and wit, he reveals life's facade, unmasking truths in a world so flawed. In Vonnegut's world, we wander and roam from Brooklyn streets to cosmic unknown. Metaphors dance, their beauty on display, inviting us to ponder in Vonnegut's sway. From the crowded corners of Brooklyn's embrace to distant planets and galaxies, outer space. His stories reflect the human condition, navigating life's turmoil with profound vision. In each chapter and verse, Profound truths reside, unrevealing life's secrets where meanings conside. Through the satire and the irony, he illuminates the way, shedding light on our world, both night and day. So let us celebrate Vonnegut's literary finesse with words that rhyme and metaphors that impress. A man without a country, a testament so grand, inviting us to explore and to understand. With gratitude in our hearts, we honor his name. Kurt Vonnegut's legacy forever aflame. In the realm of words, his spirit takes flight, guiding us through darkness with wisdom so bright.